one wants to be remembered for the amount of money they made. No one wants on their tombstone the last balance in their bank account or the title on their business card. We want to be remembered for the impact we had in the lives of others, devoted mother, loving father. I remember talking to a guy who was, it was a friend of, uh, it was the husband of my, uh, a friend of my sister's. And he was in a dark place in his career. He just lost his job and he wanted my advice. He wanted to help find the, his why. And I got on the phone with him. We started talking and I tried to find, I started asking him questions about, tell me a time in your career where you loved what you were doing. He could not think of one. He could not think of one project, one instance, one job he's ever had that he loved being a part of. And I asked him how he chose his jobs. And every single time he changed jobs, it was because of the salary that was offered to him. When he graduated college, he took the first job that offered him the highest salary. He had competing offers. The second job, he took the highest salary. The third job, he took the highest salary. He only ever took jobs that paid him more. And now he was unbelievably unhappy and had nothing to look back to, had very few relationships, had very few uh, um, loyal relationships that he could call upon because he was always selfishly directed. He had chosen to play with a finite mindset. It's a choice. It usually comes with a lot of uh, health problems as well. Creates more stress and all the other health related things that come with stress. Or we can choose to play with an infinite mindset. And what that means is we live our lives with the knowledge that we will die and we wanna leave uh, this world, our company, our families, our friends in better shape than when uh, we found them. Uh, think about that for a second, that when, when our friends and family go to our funeral, they will stand and cry and talk about that they would not be the person they are today if it weren't for having you in their lives. And so many people think about their legacies at the end of their lives when they face their own mortality. That's the problem. Only when they face their mortality do they start thinking about legacy and giving and, and giving to charity and giving it all away. Why not do that when you're 21? Why not do that when you're 18? Why not live your entire life thinking about your legacy, meaning what impact will we have in the lives of others? No one wants to be remembered for the amount of money they made. No one wants on their tombstone the last balance in their bank account or the title on their business card. We want to be remembered for the impact we had in the lives of others, devoted mother, loving father, that's how you live an infinite life, even though our lives are finite.